Ham Radio Crusader. It's time to kick it with some chew bubble gum. And I'm all out of gum. Hey everybody, it's Freddie Mac, your Ham Radio Crusader, and I'm back with another Ham Radio How-To. How would you like to program your FTM 300 and your FT5 Yesu without a programming cable? Well, this video is going to show you how to do it. All you need is a micro SD card. The first thing you need to do is go to Yesu's website and click on products and digital. Then you can click on the FTM 300DR and files. And out of the files, you can find the FTM 300 programming software. The FTM 300DR programming software right here and click on that and download and install it. Now once you insert your micro SD card into the control head of the FTM 300, you're going to want to push and hold the menu button and scroll over to SD card and push in the button to get to back up, push it in, hit right to SD card, choose all and then scroll over to OK and hit that and let it write. And what it's doing is taking your whole code plug and writing it to that SD card. All the programming information is being written to that SD card. Now, once it's completed, you're gonna back out of that menu And now it's best to power off the radio. And do a push pull on the micro SD card and out it comes. Isn't that nice? Okay, now that we're in the Yesu software, we're gonna go up to communications and get data from the SD card and all. You gotta to navigate to the SD card the micro SD card and uh, choose your FTM 300D folder. Hit backup and then the one file that you see there. And then it will load and there's all your programming data. You can fiddle around with this and go all around and make all kinds of different changes to uh, frequencies, channels, memories, settings, what have you. We're just going to add one channel here real quick. 462.650 put in a transmit frequency I don't know why I'm doing this. It's a GMRS frequency and it won't transmit anyway. But I'm just kind of demonstrating the different fields that you can edit inside the radio. Change it from automatic mode switching to FM. Give it a label, GMRS. And here you can change the PL tone if you wish. That we're done, we're going to hit save. I'm going to save it right back to where we got it. So we'll go to the backup folder where you'll have a reference for it. On to the micro SD card. But you want to hit communications and send data to SD card and hit all. That's where it actually will send the code plug data back to the micro SD card. Once you're done there, you can uh, close the program out. And go put the SD card back in the radio and power it back on. Then you're going to hit your menu. Go to SD card, go to backup. Click on it, hit read from SD card and choose all. And go over to OK and hit your button. And it will read from the SD card. and upload it to the radio. It takes just a little bit. Once it's completed, the radio should reboot. There we go. Start anew with a brand new code plug. And whammo. We'll switch over here to that channel we just added.
think I'll get that. There we go. I'll select that A side and go to GMRS and then I'll hit transmit and of course, transmit prohibited. It's GMRS. But that's how you do that. Now here's the instructions for the FT5D. Handheld radio. You're going to push and hold on your menu. Get to your main menu and you're going to select SD card and then back up. Rewrite to the SD card. And you're going to hit OK. Sometimes you got to do it a couple times. I'm kind of punchy, so it takes me a little bit to figure that out. Let's just hit OK again and whammo. It'll tell you to wait. So what it's doing is it's reading the code plug from the radio and writing it to the SD card. And complete it. So here once again you're going to power off the radio and then eject the SD card from the side. You're going to use the software in the same manner as the FTM 300 but you've got to download a separate program under the FTM 5D from the website. It's the software looks identical, but it's got a different number. Make your changes, and then uh, pop it back into your FT5D. Go to read from SD card from the SD card menu. Go to read. Hit OK. And one more time. And now we're waiting. And it takes just a moment or two. And voila! It doesn't necessarily have to reboot, and it probably didn't because I didn't make any changes, but that's how you do the, the Yaesu FT5D. No programming cable needed, just a nice SD card. I'd like to thank everyone for watching my videos. I am Freddie Mac, KD5FMU, your ham radio crusader. Be sure and check out the website at hamradiolife.org. This is KD5FMU. May the good signals be yours. Thank you all for stopping by. 73s. KD5FMU out.